hello everyone welcome back to my channel so today i'm doing a quick makeup tutorial for my eyeshadow it's just a smoky goldish eyeshadow i'm not the best at doing makeup but i'm doing this eyeshadow tutorial for beginners so this eyeshadow tutorial is mainly for beginners because i am a beginner myself so i thought it would be a good idea to do more makeup tutorials and actually like developing time so you guys can see how well i can actually do my makeup over time i'm planning to watch youtube videos and actually do it before and after videos as well for you guys please comment below and let me know if this is a good idea and if you like me to carry on and um, do makeup tutorials and just try to progress and develop myself along the way so for this part of the video i'm using this sh a shade darker than my skin so i'm using a dark brown so just to give it that lovely smoky eyeshadow that i'm actually looking for so i'm using this along my creases just to get round to the um get round to my eyelid making sure when i open my eyes you can still see that lovely dark brown on top of my eyes because i've got very long eyelashes on the other eye as you can see so it'd be really lovely for others to be able to see my eyeshadow at the same time i'm just making sure it's all blended in well just to get rid of the cakiness of an eyeshadow i'm quite a beginner so i'm still practicing this part as you can see i'm just blending 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 just to make sure and now i'm using a um a brown that's even more darker than the one that i used before so the first one that i used was a darker shade brown than my skin tone and then this one is a very darker one so now i'm going in with a black eyeshadow within my creases so i'm just blending that in within my creases just to get that lovely dark eyeshadow smoky look that i'm looking for i'm using it between the two eyeshadows that i've used before so between the two brown colors just to separate them and get that lovely dark eyeshadow that i'm looking for so it can be nice and smoky it looks really dark right now but once i blend everything in it's going to look really nice and smoky so as you can see i've already primed my eyeshadow priming your eyeshadow really helps to get the eyeshadow to pop and looks more brighter i completely forgot to prime the other eye <laughs> so i forgot to use primer on my other eye that's why the eyeshadow doesn't look as bright as the one i'm using right now so you can see the big difference i just thought it would be really good to actually show you the big difference because priming your eyeshadow just helps the color to pop more so people can notice it more especially when you have a long eyelashes like mine it's really good to have a bright eyeshadow so i love this gold color it's really really nice to get that nice smoky eye that i'm looking for so i'm just making sure i have the um, gold color in the corners of my eyes as well just making sure it's all nice and blended in and now i'm just blending in all the eyeshadows together just to get that nice finished look because the gold is not really mixed with the brown that I have on the side and it's not mixed with the black as well so I'm just making sure it's all nice and blended the key to having a nice smoky eyeshadow is making sure it's all nicely blended just to get that nice finished look so I'm just gonna keep blending and blending and blending just to make sure it looks nice because it's gonna give that lovely professional look and I'm just going over the last eyeshadow I did because as I said before, I forgot to prime it, so it will be good to get that lovely look together. And I've used a little bit of brown again to go over the black, so I can lighten the black up a bit, so it doesn't have to be too dark. As you can see, it's starting to look nice already. And 
and now I'm just adding a little bit of gold under my eyebrows just to give a little bit of a highlight color so I'm using a highlighter for this just to make my eyebrow pop more and give a little bit of a color separation between the eyeshadow and my eyebrow so as you can see it's starting to look really good guys so hopefully my makeup skills will improve with time Thank you everyone for watching my video. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe.